Hey, what's up, YouTube? I just want to show you the stylus I got. Nah, that's it in the package. Well, I have opened it and used it for a while. I just want to show you it in the package. It is a True Glide from that Lintec conductive fiber. Just show you what the back of it looks like. new conductive fiber tip it's 10 times stronger won't tear like rubber tip stylus smaller diameter you know. so let me go ahead just, it's just in a little shot of it like I said I have been using this for a while now I would like it I figured I'll make a video of it and there it is. It's the true glide. So you got the pocket clip. The conductive fiber tip. Now this pocket clip did come off the other day. But it easily fits back on. If you look right here, I don't know if you really see, but you see the the color on it starting to fade a little bit, you know, from the oils in your hand and rubbing on it and holding it, you know, the this was that brash or something. It does tarnish a little bit. That's pretty shiny. The tip on it is real good. It's a nice weight. Feels good in the hands. You know when you're drawing. Uh, so let me go ahead and turn on this and check it out. Bring that down. So now, if I just drop it on the iPad and just like move it around, it don't really register. But if you just add like a, just a little tiny bit of pressure on it, you know, not much, just a tiny itty bitty bit of pressure. Let's see, I'll go ahead and check out this draw free app or draw something, whatever it's called. Um, go ahead. I'll just write real quick, see if I show you. See, it writes good. Oh, that's it. Well, see, it writes real good. Let's just do some scribbles. You know. That's... That's real fine lines, scribbles real good. Hmm. Go ahead and send that. Um it's stylus works really good. If you open this up. If you type. Yeah. It's real. It's real good. I mean, you just barely touch it, and it registers. Um, I did draw something to fear. Playing a game like this, I didn't think the stylus would be good for playing Infinity Blade Two or anything. It works good on the iPhone. And I didn't think it would, you know, be that effective on the, you know, big screen like the iPad. Let's go ahead and see. Damn it.
Yeah. Works pretty good. Um, if you're playing a game like Amateur Surgeon, it works good too. I mean, since I got the stylist, I was like, you know what, I'm going to download this game. It's a Cartoon Network game. I played it before, you know, just trying it out. I didn't really like it on the iPhone, using your fingers. So I was like, well, since I got the iPad with the bigger screen, let me go ahead and try it out. And with the stylist, it works really good. So that's how it is with the stylist. Um, I kind of suck at this part. So as you see, for like a game like this, it works really good. You know, the stylus is awesome. I like it. Like I said, it's a nice size. The weight is good. The conductive fiber tip on it is awesome. It slides on the iPad effortlessly. It doesn't stick or skip or nothing. It doesn't lag. It's not like a rubber tip where you're like, squeaky, 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 squeaky. I mean, underneath this conductive fiber, if you feel it, it is a rubber tip underneath it. It feels like. But it's like a rubber tip wrapped in this um conductive fiber. So if you look, it is a rubber tip. So I don't know if over time is that rubber tip on the bottom like gonna dry out and crack or anything. But since it's not the rubber tip itself rubbing on the device I think, yeah, it is. I think this tip is going to last a long time. I had it for like, I think over a week. And it's still performing just as good as it did the day I bought it. So, yeah. I've been using it for typing. I've been using it on my iPhone, on my iPad. You know, I use it for, you know, like checking emails. You know. I use it for everything, you know. If I'm listening to like Pandora, you know, up here at the top where you want to like and, you know, thumbs up and thumbs down songs. Yeah, or hit this, you know, I find it really easy to hit the buttons. Yeah. You know, so you can, you can like. Well, you know, easy to hit the buttons. I mean, it's probably just as easy to do with your finger because. When you use your finger, it's way more sensitive to the touch. With this, you do got to apply just a little bit of pressure. But as far as the pinpoint accuracy that comes with it, I do like it. Yeah. So, yeah. There's not really much else I can say about the stylist. I like it. Everything I use it for, it works good. I do like the um, pocket flip because me, since I got the iPhone and stuff, I want my iPhone like with me at all times because I take it with me wherever I go. So I wear um, dress shirts that have front pockets just for my phone you know I don't put nothing in there 
fuck my phone. You know, because... I don't want to throw my phone in my jacket pocket or pants pocket and accidentally, like, bump into something and boom, I just smash my phone or the phone falls out your pocket, you know, or you take your jacket off. I don't want to be like, oh, shit, my phone's in my jacket. I got to read it. I keep my phone in my pocket at all times. So it's cool that this stylus does have this pocket clip that um I can stick this in the pocket with my phone and keep my stylus with me at all times. And it's small enough to where if you're just walking around the house wearing like some shorts or something, you just throw it in your pocket in your shorts. You know. It does suck to that. Let me unplug this wire. That when you close your iPad, the pocket clip isn't big enough to like slide onto, you know, the case. Because I see that case is thick. So I just wish it was a little bit more givey or springy to where you can like just slide it on the case or, you know, something. I mean, this is a good case. I like this case. I had this case for a long time now. I just wish there's a spot on here where I can um you know, fix the stylus to the case. A little protector up in there. Now, if I would have got the True Glide stylus that had the little plastic thing, I could have just took this out and just plugged the stylus in there I just had it hanging from the pad on a little string. I don't really want something hanging from my iPad. You know. So, I went with the one with the pocket clip that didn't have the thing hanging. So, yeah. That's my look at my stylus. Like I said, I've been using it all the time. What's up, YouTube? And for my iPad and this stylus, it's a perfect combination. Same thing the iPhone. I'm loving it. Thanks for watching. I know this video is getting kind of long, and I got to get going. So, see you later, YouTube. See you later.